Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Nyla and if you like all things luxury or the little luxuries of life, I think you're going to like it here. Okay, so today I'm going to be sharing with you guys some luxury and non-luxury purchases that I've just made throughout the month of January. Since February has started, I figured, why not? So first, I want to discuss these two books by Colleen Hoover. It ends with us and it starts with us. So I actually finished this book. I read the entire thing within like the first four days. Uh, my boyfriend got me these books and I was so excited. So I'm gonna start this one probably tonight and I'm really excited because I enjoyed that one a lot. Next, from Versace. So I don't know if you guys know, but Versace, they go on sale quite often. Because this year I've been really into like getting stuff on sale, getting stuff for a deal, discount, whatever. So the Versace had a sale and I picked something up. So here, oh, this is wrapped so nicely. The packaging is so pretty. Okay, so I got this dress. It is a monogram dress and... On the sleeves, they have the little Medusa on here. It's so cute. It's like a bodycon dress. It's pretty fitted. I really like it. It's a thick knit material. It's really nice. I don't know. I just love it. I, I love a good monogram moment. I like being loud. I like being quiet. It just depends on my mood, if I'm being honest with you. So I'm really excited about this. This dress was on such a good sale, marked down so low. It was over $1,000 retail and on the Versace website it went on sale so I was like let me just let me just snag this real quick oh I just realized I'm lacking in my jewelry today oh well let's go on to something I ordered from Yugi's and I'm really really excited about this because if you've watched my previous videos I've said how on my wish list I have the squeeze bag um, from Loewe and I really like that bag. I also really like the Chanel 22 although it's not on my wish list and I found a bag that I think is pretty reminiscent of it. Ta-da! Okay, so, so this is the Burberry Lola bag and to me it's like that same kind of style like it's like a bottomless pit bag that's gonna be pretty slouchy like once you start putting things in it the leather's not too stiff there's not like any real good form to it and it's just I don't know it's so cute sorry my cats are playing with a cardboard box right now and one of them is just going crazy Ralphie Ralphie stop playing with the box mommy's trying to film something anywho here she is I think it's so cute oh my gosh I've never seen this style of bag before. Actually, the reason I even found out about this bag was I was watching this movie on Netflix and it has Kevin Hart in it and it's like he's some type of big heist guy. He goes on heist and he does art theft, something like that. It was pretty funny and they had to go uh, undercover and they were on a plane and one of the main characters had this bag in a brown color. And I was like, what is that bag? I've never seen that bag. Like, I don't know, was it just me? Did I miss it or did Burberry just not really ever promote this bag when it came out? Because it's not on their website anymore. That's why I had to go pre-love. And I'm not mad at it at all one bit. I got it for a good deal. Well, let me let me throw it on. Let me just... Oh my gosh. Guys. And because there's two chains here, you can crossbody it. Well, I probably would put this in there. Like this. But you can crossbody it. I don't know. I'm just... I'm obsessed with this bag. I don't even know at this point if I'm going to get the squeeze anymore, if I really need to. I just, I don't know. This bag would have went perfect for my alternatives video. If I'd known it existed when I filmed that, I would have totally included it and would have been so happy to share this bag. Like, I'm so excited about this. The leather is beautiful. I love the color of it. I love the gold hardware. It's amazing, and I'm so satisfied with this. Honestly, I don't think I have ever felt like... Okay, yeah, I'm just not going to get this bag on my wish list eventually because blah, blah, blah. No, like, I actually feel that way. I feel like now maybe I am not going to get the squeeze. I don't know. I guess time will tell. Next, Lululemon. Yes, I got two things from Lululemon. Y'all, I know, I know he made a comment. I know the CEO or somebody, whoever, someone who works for Lululemon made a comment about the type of people he didn't want entering his stores or whatever, why not? I know. Look. What can you do? I don't know. I just, whatever. 
whatever i could care less about what he has to say to be quite honest with you first i got this like sports bra and the sun's kind of shining but let me get closer it's in a pink it's in a light baby pink and i got the light baby pink jacket to match so cute i know the baby pink color has been like super popular and then always goes sold out and then it's never available and blah 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 well i don't like to order lululemon online like i would rather just go in the store and get what i can get and they had it in stock finally this color so i was like i'm just gonna get it i wasn't gonna pay a reseller of lululemon you know more money than i should because it wasn't in stock or wasn't available whatever so i got that which i'm pretty excited to wear i'm probably gonna overwear it like i will wear that type of stuff into the ground i wear my lululemon align jacket into the ground already as it is so it is what it is you know so that was lulu next is from aj i believe that's how you say that i think i'm saying it correctly so aj also was having a sale and i got two things from the sale i actually haven't opened these yet so i'm opening them now Package so nice. I love that they put it, this stuff in a little dust bag. I think that's so cute. Okay, so first, I got this like camel color sweater, and it's a pullover, and it's a turtleneck, and it just says Aj on the front and like script writing. I think that's really cute. I really like that. That's adorable. Me personally, I love a good pullover. I love a good turtleneck, and I wear so many of these during cold weather. And I don't actually own that many. Like I'm the type of person that the stuff I have, I wear and I'll rewear and rewear. So this is going to come in handy for me. I don't see any problem with rewearing outfits, rewearing clothes. Like if it's cute, rewear it. Wear it to the ground. Wear it until you can't no more. I'm a firm believer in that, and I will always advocate for people rewearing their outfits, especially if it's a good one. The second thing I got from Aj was a dress, and I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. The dress I got is in this, like, beautiful poppy color. I'm trying to figure out how to open it. Hold on. Chop, stop. Nelly needs to say hello first. Say hi, Nelly. Say hi, Chanel. Is you mommy, baby? You are mommy's big girl. Finally got it open. I don't know why I was struggling so bad. But it is this beautiful poppy seed color dress like it flounces out i love that it is so cute and oh look at this hold on it has wrapping on it i gotta get it off it protected it pretty nice oops i bought clothes from this brand before but i i don't think i ever did i order online from there were they available somewhere in person i don't know i don't know but they packaged this so nice and it, it has this beautiful buckle in the front i think it is so cute i'm so happy with this dress i love the color i love the shape so cute and there's like some underwiring here okay i don't know how that's going to feel on but we'll see i'm excited i'm hoping for the best i just love the way it flounces out like it just oh so perfect and this is some very thick material. Very, very, very thick. I don't know what it's made of, but this thing is so thick. You guys, no, 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 no. We don't eat plastic and paper. No, no, no. We don't do that. I can never just, like, open stuff, guys. Ralphie break. Hi, Ralphie. Say hi, Ralphie. You're so cute, boo-boo. You're so cute. You're so cute. You're so cute. You're so cute. Okay, I love you. Next, this is from a brand I found online when I was just like browsing and I was looking for like sweaters. And I found this sweater from this place called Fox Sweaters. Oh, let me button it up real quick so that I can show you the silhouette. I love a good sweater. I will wear a sweater. Anywhere I go, I have to have a sweater because I'm constantly cold. Like, I don't know. I always get cold. I love the winter. Winter's my favorite. But I always get cold, even in the summer. When I step inside of a restaurant and it's like freezing in there i don't know like that's just that's just not for me it, it'd be too cold in there and i'd be like oh i need my sweater so yeah okay so i got it all buttoned up but here is the sweater it's really cute and it has like these wide sleeves but i don't know it's so cute they're kind of like a bell i would say but it cinches in at the waist i don't think you can tell on the camera but it does like go in at the waist and it's so flattering this sweater is very, very flattering. 
and honestly the material is really nice and it didn't cost that much like it was i think like it was 80 dollars around there 80 dollars 85 dollars it was not bad at all yeah really really excited about that i'm excited to wear that sweater finally the last january purchase i want to share with you guys is this these are ooh, the, the lace is just hanging out the lace is just hanging out y'all my bad sorry these are the daydream sneakers from hermes with rose gold hardware i'm obsessed i'm obsessed with this little just cute just oh it's just so adorable the little lock here i'm thinking like oh my gosh if only my birkin had rose gold hardware oh my god but that's okay because i mix metals all the time so i've already worn them out i have I know, I couldn't help it. I just couldn't help it. But yeah, I am so excited to have these. They are so cute. Like seriously, they're so cute. So with white sneakers, I don't have a bunch of them. I have basic Air Forces and then I have a pair of Balenciaga sneakers. But they're more of a cream to me rather than a white. These are like white. They're beautiful. I think they're going to look so cute when I like, wear my D-Joy. Really with any bag with any outfit these could look cute because they're just a basic white sneaker with videos such as my own i think it's really important to remember this was a collective haul for me this was throughout the entire month of january i didn't get all of this just in one shopping trip so i think that's important to remember i know for some people they'll easily spend that much on one shopping trip and i'm not saying i haven't before i have many times but i'm trying to slow down on shopping and cut back on shopping in general I want to enjoy my items and I really want to just be satisfied with what I have. That's why this year on my wish list, I did not have that much on there. And the bags that I had on there, one of them I already checked off. I'm hoping to get another one on there soon. And then the third one, I don't even know if I'm going to get anymore because I have an alternative that was less money and it's still super cute. Well, hello. Hi. Uh-oh. Well, the baby fell, so that's a little unfortunate. Are you okay? Are you okay? Mm -hmm. So, yeah, I think that it's important to remember that. I know sometimes we can get caught up in, like, the luxury game, buying luxury things, but that's why I included luxury and non-luxury purchases. I just kind of want to show things that I've bought in general. They don't have to be luxury. I think anything you buy can be fun to share and show. So those are my thoughts on that. If any of you have bought anything exciting this month or anything you're really thrilled to share or use drop a comment down below let me know let me know if you liked any of the stuff that I've included in this video if there's anything you're thinking of getting anything you're hoping to get in February yeah just let me know drop a comment I'd be really excited to hear I love chatting with anybody in my comments it's really exciting for me so yeah with all of that said I hope you guys enjoyed my video and I hope to see you again soon bye